first thing you will do is open your Tinkercad and then sign up your account. And then as you can see, click the circuits and then create new circuit. And then you can see the components in the component panels. Drag the Arduino in the black sp blank space and then put the name and Arduino. Next is drag the breadboard. Then search the ultrasonic sensor. I choose the ultrasonic distance sensor that has a four pins. Then put the sensor. The next one is I search the buzzer. So I put the buzzer in the breadboard. The next one is I drag the LED. Then next is the resistor, which is the twi two two hundred twenty ohms. Those are the components I use on my project. So next is the connection. The first thing is I, I have the connection and the breadboard for the rows panels to have the connection in each rows. Next is the connection for the LED which is the which is in the ground then the next is the connection for the ground of Arduino to the breadboard which is I colored it a black one the next connection is the second pin of the resistor to the digital pin of the Arduino which is the digital pin number 13 and I colored it into an orange one. Let's proceed the other connection which is the other the terminal one of the buzzer which is in the ground. And I colored it into the black one. The next connection is the second terminal of the buzzer which is I connected it into the digital pin of the Arduino which is the digital pin number 11 which is I colored it into a purple. Then the next connection is the the ground of the Arduino. Oh no, the power of the Arduino 
to the pin number 1 of the ultrasonic sensor which is the power and I colored it into the red one the next connection is the second pin of the ultrasonic sensor which is the trigger pin into the digital pin number 10 of the Arduino which is I colored it into the yellow one then the next connection which is the echo pin of the ultrasonic sensor I connected into the digital number 9 of the Arduino and then I colored it into the green one the last connection is the the ground of the Arduino to the fourth pin of the ultrasonic sensor which is the VCC or the ground also of the ultrasonic sensor and I colored it into the black one the next is for the coding As you can see, the, uh, there's already a code. Then the first code is first I have to define the pin numbers, which is the trigger pin is equal to the pin number 10 of the Arduino, then the echo pin is to 9, and then the buzzer is to pin 11, and then the lead pin is to pin number 13 in the Arduino the next one is define the variables which is the the jury the long duration the distance in the V next is the void setup and for the void setup sets the trig pin as an output and then sets the echo pin as an input then the buzzer is the output and the lead pin is the output the next is sets the serial communication you can see the coding for this is the you can uh, there's also the reads the echo pin returns the sound wave travel time in microseconds and then let's start the simulation So it the uh, the buzzer was ringing. The buzzer was ringing, and then also the LED was uh, as a light. It is because which is the distance is less than 10 and then if more than 10 or greater than 10 it 